Hello and welcome to Efficient Strategy Gaming. Today I'd like to show you how to roll back your version of Hearts of Iron 4. Today there was a patch that was just dropped, the Hydra update, and it made the game so that I was unable to uh, play any of my previous saves. Uh, I was freaking out for a moment here since I needed to play a save that I did a few days ago. I recently created a video with Lieutenant Joker uh, showing how to set up the Barbarossa campaign and I was going to create another video today on how on basically a playthrough of the Barbarossa campaign to see how everything turned out uh, with just uh, gameplay. So anyway, uh, this is the page on the Paradox Interactive website and I'll post a link in the description box below and this shows you how to revert your game to a previous patch level and that's important because then you're going to be able to play your previous saves that will be locked if say you're like me and you just get automatic downloads. So let's go ahead and show you how to roll back the version of Hearts of Iron 4 in Steam. So as you can see here, I'm in my Steam library, and it's very easy. All you have to do is right-click on Hearts of Iron 4, click Properties, and then go under the tab Betas, and click this arrow box here, and you can literally uh, roll back to whatever version of Hearts of Iron 4 you'd like. Uh, this Hydra version just came out and it has a lot of different rebalancing updates and it also comes with a picture pack for germany japan and italy's tanks so that's kind of cool uh, but i'm gonna set mine to the old ironclad update which i've already downloaded uh, and as soon as you click this you'll see that it'll start downloading down here and if you click library and go to your downloads, you'll be able to see it downloading. And then the next time you hit play, you'll be to that old version and you should be able to play any of your old saves uh, that was for that version of gameplay. So thanks for joining me and uh, please like and subscribe if you enjoy this content and I'll see you on the next one.